Pi Day. Welcome to MC in Focus, Montgomery County's only student-produced newscast. I'm Heather Welliver. And I'm Asia Norris. The TV production program at Montgomery College is a great program. I enjoyed taking all of the TV courses, including television production, advanced television production, advanced broadcast journalism, and video editing. My overall experience in uh, TV production has been really good. I've uh, experienced a lot. I've gone through learning things that I, I knew a little bit about before I came in, but I got to progress and really adapt to the environment as well. It was a lot of fun. I was surprised how much fun I had. I, we did a lot of hands-on and that made a big difference. We did the book learning thing. You know, you have to get all the terminology down and everything first. But we really jumped in quickly, learning how to operate the equipment and how to make a production. And everybody really had a good time. That's what I love most about um, TV production is the editing part because you get to create um, the emotion in the videos. And taking all of those classes, you also get to learn how the TV um, world works. So it was pretty fun. The best parts of the programs were when uh, when uh, they go full on and teaching you how to white balance a camera to make sure that you, your colors are right and also being able to switch from not just being a cameraman but to be a producer or director and yeah just getting to know each role and what, what purpose they serve and how they can affect the other role if you're not doing it the right way. In class I was learning actual directing skills. I got to set up, sit at the board and, and uh, run the board. I got to go into uh, the audio room and run the audio. I got, you know, everything. Uh, running cameras, producing. I got the chance to uh, produce my EFP class's uh, final project. The part of the program that I felt I got the most benefit from has to be directing because I got to learn how to uh, become a director and fully take on the role of letting the crew know what's next. It needs to be cute, what needs to be ready for the show to roll live on air. So directing the TD, the technical director, to make sure that the cameras get taken uh, on time. That's right, folks. First place baseball in the nation's capital and in Baltimore. The Will Nationals Smith. open Will up Smith. a series against Will, Will the Smith. Oakland, uh, <laughs> the Oakland against the Athletics the and, the and, and also the Orioles shot. open up. All of the professors in the TV uh, production program are great. The professors are there to help you out no matter what. Our teachers were fantastic. They know what they're talking about. They're knowledgeable of the subject. They have great delivery and I enjoyed um, being a part of even though you run into some issues, but bump heads, but you eventually uh, learn that they're there to help you and guide you throughout the field. Like Joanne Carl, she, she really pushed me to, to realize, okay, this is how it's done in the industry, so this is the standard. Even though I know there may be ways that I want to do it, but I know that it's the standard and that's the way you're going to get a job in this field. Professor Koch uh, has been in the business for a long time and he brings a lot of stories and a lot of experience to the table and I love hearing about what he did, what he's um, been through. Professor Feldman was a really good writing teacher. She is really hard on deadlines so it helped me to not be a procrastinator and aside from learning the job skill and learning broadcast journalism it also helped me build character. They were all fantastic. They have fun and it rubs off on you. All my classmates, we, we always had a great time. It was more like play than work, but we're learning and particularly getting to do so much. It was invaluable. My overall experience with Montgomery College has been positive. It's been great. It's been fun as well. My education became more of my hobby instead of just, you know, viewing it as, oh, it's education, you know, some people view it as boring. It became more of a hobby and helping me realize this is you know what I'm gonna do for the rest of my life and I, and I, I actually enjoy saying that. One day uh, we were in class and uh, a couple people came in 
and they were from Montgomery College Television, from MCTV. They come in to tell us that there were internship opportunities um, at MCTV. And so I immediately applied. And I got in, and it was one of the best things that's ever happened to me. I was taking the advanced TV production course when I got the job at Montgomery College Television. The internship that I got here at Montgomery College Television gave me a little leadership in the courses that I was learning at Montgomery College. So in my classes, I was able to help other students with um, things that they weren't aware of. And I think that this internship was a great experience really, really love it here at MCTV. It's fantastic, the whole, the whole group is great, from the producer directors to the other student production assistants. Um, we're all, all like a close family. But the thing is, they encourage you to grow. And they're not trying to keep you stuck, they want you, they want to empower us. The different positions that I learned and got to perform in my TV courses and at MCTV were directing, technical directing, system directing. I got to learn how to work the Chiron a little bit, teleprompting, camera operating, doing PTR and also audio. That's what I really enjoy is that while working at MCTV, I'm learning at the same time I'm performing and it'll help me when I get a job in the TV field. What's wonderful is that Montgomery College has connections with Discovery Communications and they actually offered an opportunity for Montgomery College students specifically to get internships there and I got lucky enough to get it. So I'm really excited to move forward and to keep growing and doing that with, a, with Discovery is a dream come true. I would like to thank Professor Carl and Professor Koch for helping me craft my ability to be a director, producer, a cameraman. So yeah, I would like to thank them for that. I just want to thank everyone for giving me the opportunity to work with them, to be a part of their team, to everyone that gave me a, a chance to do things and learn from them. I'm really happy that they did that for me and I hope that I did something for them. I'm a mom. I've got a five-year-old little boy and I've been attending MC for two and a half years so that's half his life. If it weren't for the Early Learning Center right here on campus, I wouldn't be able to attend classes. And knowing that he was in good hands, first of all, was a great comfort. And the really cool thing I'm going to miss is being able to step outside and hear my child laughing on the playground. He's right there, right there. And, and what a comfort knowing that uh, any time that he needed me, I could be there. Good morning, and welcome to Montgomery College's 2014 ceremony. Jose Martin Ruiz. That feeling of walking across the stage, it's got to be amazing. It's got to feel like an accomplishment. Finally, it's like, thank God I, I finished, you know, my education. I can finally be proud holding the diploma. And it feels wonderful to have graduated from my field. And hopefully uh, this degree also leads me to uh, a job that I might enjoy doing forever. Asia Norris. Well, graduating is always a very exciting moment because you passed, you made it, and although it seems so far away, when you do graduate, it feels like it went by really fast, and that's what I am a little sad about. When I get my name called and I go on stage and I shake Dr. Paul's hand, I hope I just smile and It'll be tears of joy if the tears start rolling. And you know, I'll give you a hug. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Heather Bailey with honors. Getting to walk across the stage means a lot to me, particularly because I didn't get to do this in high school. 
I was a I was a dropout. I, I had different ambitions and different priorities, and being able to prove myself and to have my family see me walk across the stage and and uh, get my certificates, I'm I'm proud and um, I that I can set an example for my son and, and that he gets to see that, it, it means I'm so glad I came. So my future plans is to run my own business and right now I have this thing called J Martin Films. There's a Facebook page, a website, and it's pretty much me and my friend who started it. And so far there's kind of a high demand. So we've been doing weddings, we've been doing music videos, interviews, and promoting businesses locally. So I've been doing a lot of commercials for that. And yeah, hopefully this is what I end up doing to further kind of progress what I really want to do, which is film at the end. So we'll see where it goes from there. I have been applying to a couple of jobs, so I do want to get a job in the media field. And I don't really care what I do because I like everything about TV and the and what's great is that I got to learn a lot of things working here that I can apply at a job that I'll get in the future. I'm staying open to opportunity. That's what's gotten me this far. And so I'm not going to take for granted that I might get a job at Discovery. I'm going to plug away. I'm going to apply for jobs and uh, just keep improving my skills. But I would just love to to host something where I'm talking about something that, that I'm passionate about that, that is personal to me. That would be that would be the dream job right there. I want to say thank you mom for supporting me throughout the years and making sure that you allowed me to do what I wanted to do, not what you know family would like me to do. But you know, thank you for that. You know, I've had good times. Um, I can't name any bad times. I don't think there were any bad times because it was just fun. TV is fun. <laughs> I specifically want to say thank you to the people at Montgomery College Television because I feel like it really helped supplement my education here at MC. I'm looking forward to the future. I'm really excited. I love Montgomery College. Montgomery College is one of the best community colleges in the universe.